welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a USD preview surface node to view your materials in the Hydro Viewer. So open the Dragon Katana project from the downloadable course files and expand the scene graph fully to load everything in the scene. Jump inside the Network Material Create node for the Dragon and create a USD preview surface node. We can now connect the surface output to the USD surface input for the Dragon network material on the terminal sidebar. If you open the parameters for the USD preview surface node, you can now make adjustments to the colour, roughness, metallic and any other parameters you like. But you'll notice that nothing is showing up in the Hydra Viewer yet, and that's because we need to disable the basic materials in the Hydra Viewer in order for our USD materials to be visible. So click View and untick the Basic Material option. And now you'll be able to see your USD material. So the next thing you probably want to do is to feed in your texture files instead of having a block colour. To do this, create a USD UV texture node Open the parameters and in the file field, navigate to the Dragon Albedo texture file. As this texture uses UDIMS, we'll need to change the 1001 number for UDIM and put angle brackets around it. Now we can just connect the RGB output to the diffuse colour input on the USD preview surface node. And then we can see the texture on the dragon in the Hydra Viewer. If you go back to the view menu, you can also switch on shadows from all or selected lights to get an idea of where the shadows are being cast on your objects. In the next video, I'm going to take you through creating USD lights.